Gulliver in the Land of Giants. Voyages are important to explore different lands and to know different kinds of people. Voyages bring a sense of adventure to our lives in exploring the unknown. This story is about Gulliver's stay in a land of giants. Let us read how this came to be. A fierce storm carried our ship to a faraway place. On 16th June 1703, we discovered this land. The next day, some of the men and I reached the land. While the other men stayed close to the boat, I wandered off. Suddenly, I heard a commotion and before I could get to the boat, my fellow travelers had left, leaving me alone in the strange land. A huge creature was running after them in the sea. I ran, climbed a steep hill and found myself in a cornfield with stalks that seemed 40 feet high, threatened to be squashed or cut in two by the reaping hook of the giants who had appeared. I shouted to make my presence felt. One of the giants picked me and took me to his master, the farmer. I was placed on the ground and the giant sat around me. To appear friendly, I presented my purse of gold. The farmer wrapped me in his handkerchief and took me to his house. I was invited for dinner with the farmer's family. The dinner was eventful with the farmer's son holding me upside down, a cat that was least interested in me and a one-year-old child who tried to gobble me. After dinner, the farmer handed me over to the nurse who put me on her bed and covered me with a clean handkerchief. As I dreamt in my sleep, two rats attacked me. I fought them with a hanger. Hearing the noise, the nurse came inside and picked me in her palm. I told her that I fought bravely and assured her that I will always protect her.